50th anniversary of the 26th Amendment in the Constitution and joining us three students from the Civic Center who are shining a light on the power of the youth vote and civic engagement. The Civic Center is a nonprofit, nonpartisan organization that encourages and empowers teens all around the United States to register, pre-register to vote and to inform and provide resources regarding elections, how to register to vote, and conducts reports about what has changed. So this year's anniversary of the 26th Amendment, which allowed the voting age to be lowered to 18, it's important to me because as under underrepresented youth, I'm allowed to now be able to vote. The 26th Amendment is so powerful, and it tells me that I'm now on level playing field with everyone else in our country who's voting. And that's really cool because when we're talking about democracy, we're talking about each vote matters. Pre-registration laws will allow an individual who is under the age of 18 to fill out a form. Having a driver's license or a permit is already a difficult thing on its own. So these small municipal things kind of add up over time. And it's one of the biggest hurdles when it comes to youth turnout. Unfortunately, it's that idea of, oh, having to go register to vote, fill out paperwork, that drives teens away from going out and engaging with their democracy. When it comes to youth like me, youth who are disadvantaged or youth who are from underrepresented minority groups, voting is sort of an access or the key to unlocking some of the issues that they can finally speak on. If you're a little lost when it comes to kickstarting wood registration at your school, one of the first and most important things to do would be to look at in school support that you already have. You don't have to have everything figured out. You don't have to know everything in the world. We are so motivated right now as a generation to be involved, to care, to actively seek information, to actively ask those questions. And I hope that never stops. We can continue to have a seat at the table. And when we're discussing and we're debating issues, young people's stances and young people's point of view will be represented. What incredible teenagers there. And to learn more about the Civic Center, head to the GMA3 Facebook page. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.